Hey everybody, World Peace is coming, and it's going to be here a lot sooner than many of us may believe. World Peace, which can be defined as the end of institutionalized war, meaning no more corporately or politically organized armed conflict, will be here within two decades. Now, the idea of world peace within 20 years may seem like an impossible dream. Rest assured, it is firmly rooted in reality. Here are three reasons why. Reason 1. Our world is getting better every single day. There are many factors that lead to a better world, and a gain in any one of these factors makes it easier to achieve gains across all others. This is something I like to call the snowball effect, and it shows us how we are approaching a better world at increasing speed. One of the most influential factors contributing to a better world is technology. New technology has been arriving at exponential speeds and will continue to bring us cheaper, better tools sooner and sooner. To see just how fast we will be progressing, it is important to understand what exponential means. Here is a graph showing two kinds of growth, linear and exponential. While the two start off at similar rates, the line representing exponential growth begins to take a sharp turn upwards. Many leading futurists believe we've already crossed the point where growth starts to curve upwards, meaning over the next few decades we will see an incredible rate of progress. Our new technology, when combined with the other areas of world improvement, will allow us to meet the basic needs of all the world's people, spelling the end of extreme poverty forever. Poverty, as many will attest, is a root grievance that contributes to conflict and war. So as we continue to address the issues of poverty around the world, we will continue to see a decline in the demand for war. And already we can see two signs of this coming true. Global poverty has been dropping for centuries, and our world today is the most peaceful it has ever been in modern human history. Reason number two, we are uniting on unprecedented levels. Along with allowing us to meet the basic needs of the world's people, technology also brings unprecedented powers of communication and community building, bringing us together like never before. The unifying power of the internet will continue to spread around the world, bringing us into what many call the global village, where we identify ourselves as being part of the world's community. With each new day, more and more of us are integrating ourselves into this new paradigm, where our common humanity takes precedence over our superficial differences. Eventually, as this trend continues, we will no longer have entire nations willing to fight each other, because we will come to see the members of those other nations as being part of our own extended families. Reason number three, with solidarity comes power. These communities we've been building will continue to grow in size and might to become more powerful than corporations or governments, and instant messaging tools will allow us to mobilize to action in real time. Our new technology is consistently shifting the balance of power into our hands, and we will use it to make our world a better place equality, prosperity, and peace will become cornerstones for our new world. We will use our new power to enact one of the most important steps towards world peace, an affront on the entity primarily responsible for institutionalized war in our world. The military-industrial complex, also known as the war machine, is an entity that reaps trillion dollar profits from war, and therefore has a vested interest in perpetuating conflict on Earth. In a struggle that will parallel the fight against big tobacco, we will hold these death dealers accountable for the damage they've done to our people and planet. By harnessing our powers of solidarity, we will forever dismantle the war machine, condemning it as a relic of an era gone by. All of these factors, a consistently improving world, humankind uniting like never before, and harnessing the power of the world's people, will, over the next two decades, culminate in something that has eluded us for so long an end to institutionalized war. World peace really is coming. Believe it. Stay tuned for more rational reasons to be optimistic about the future and remember to stay positive.